Hello, and welcome to this tutorial on how to build a course step by step using AI tools like ChatGBT and more. My name's Alex, and I'm from CourseBot, a platform that helps anyone create a course faster and easier than ever before. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the process of creating an engaging online course using AI tools. So let's get started. So I'm going to presume that you've already heard of or try it out chat GPT if you're watching this video. If you haven't, well, you've been living under a rock. Good morning. <laughs> when it comes to creating high quality courses, there's a number of written aspects that chat GPT can help speed up and add creativity to. These include written text on your course topics, quizzes, assessment, exercises, video scripts, and so much more. But First, uh, you know, this is the part of ChatGBT uh, that I am so excited about, uh, which is designing the initial structure of your course. So it's important to remember with ChatGBT, when you enter a prompt, you may get better answers when your prompt is really specific. So ChatGBT is going to write drafts for you and they're rarely going to be perfect. But hey, wouldn't we all like to start with a draft rather than writing everything from scratch? So I'll put this prompt template in the description of this video in case you want to make use of it. Uh, basically, I'm going to edit the parts I want uh, from that template and uh, then we'll be able to essentially design a course. So you can see I've put uh, the topic as cybersecurity for new staff at Coursebox and the length as three hours. And then sort of the aspects uh, of what I want to be included within that, uh, the parts of the course. And then one final assessment at the end as well. So I'm gonna run that now. Okay, cool. So you can see that starting to come out. Uh, so first, once that's done, we're going to have to obviously confirm that we're happy with that. If we need to make any edits, uh, then we can. Um, you can just redo the prompt in a different way. You can also see I've got down here a, a Chrome extension with ChatGPT that gives you access to uh, web, the most up-to-date website results. Um, I do find sometimes that does make the quality of your response from ChatGPT worse. So I've got that turned off now, but if it's something that, uh, let's say something happens in the news like a day or two ago, uh, this can be quite a good one to use uh, if you want to. Which pretty cool what it's given me. It's actually given me a title, an objective, a structure with different parts and it, how long it takes for each of those parts, topics under each of those parts, and then uh, yeah, materials that will need to be created uh, for each of those. Hypothetically, if I'm happy with this now, I would then go and generate content for each of the sub topics. So for example, uh, the role of course box staff in cybersecurity, if we wanted to create specific content on that one sub topic, we could then go and say, um, please write me um, three paragraphs on um, control B to copy the page, sorry, and then um, you could also say, um, please write uh, two quiz questions on the topic as well. So you're starting to get the gist. We can, you know, use uh, the topics that have been created from this and then start to create content uh, on that. And then also we can uh, not just, you know, write text like we've seen here, we can sort of write quizzes, we can write uh, video scripts. Right. So you can see that we've got these video scripts back here, even with prompts as to sort of what we could uh, add in there as sort of ways, which is quite cool. Going back to this text and these quizzes, obviously you'll need to go through and do that for each of these different uh, topics and subtopics. You will need to uh, 
edit those and copy and paste those into your course builder or LMS. GBT does have a word or connector limit to some extent. So um, just be aware if you went to ask for a huge amount of text on all of these topics at the same time, you probably would reach that limit uh, and get cut off. So that's why I'm sort of I'm encouraging you to uh, separate it out. So Synthesia is honestly my personal favorite AI video course creation tool. Uh, there's a bunch of other ones out there that you can check out, um, which I'll put in the description of this video, but uh, Synthesia um, is really awesome. It allows you to create training videos easily from inputting a script or text uh, content into the tool. And it will generate a video that looks like it's been filmed with a lifelike human avatar delivering the content. Like it's honestly scaringly close to looking like a real person. And so you can customize the avatar's appearance, voice, and even add uh, background music to make the video more engaging. The avatars can even speak a bunch of different languages. Uh, so what I um, would usually do in this scenario is I'd actually generate um, a draft video script using ChatGBT and then um, would obviously edit that and input that into Synthesia. Uh, so I've gone ahead and just um, created sort of a, a very simple sample one here. Um, basically, Synthesia does cost $30 per month if you're going to use like the main um, software to, to do it. You don't really, there's not really like sort of a, a really good free version, but um, you can get like just a quick demo um, of it uh, for free. Uh, so that's what I'm doing here. Um, you know, if you are going to create really high quality videos quickly without a production team, um, then it is a great alternative. And quite frankly, $30 is pretty cheap when you think about how much it would cost in labor and equipment to make a video just like it in, in real life. Um, so you can go to Synthesia.io uh, to find out a bit more sort of information on it um, and see some of the video demos there. Um, I've gone in and um, basically copy and pasted that uh, chat GBT one into here. Um, obviously, I could go ahead and edit some things in there and then sort of submitted uh, it to get a free demo video back, uh, which I will show you now. Learn how to create an online course using AI tools in just a few clicks. Watch now. So there are other AI tools that can be used for generating voice based on text which you could, of course, get from ChatGPT in terms of the text side of it. Um, there's a lot of AI image generation apps as well that can be used. Uh, I personally find that stock images, videos, or uh, even YouTube videos from other creators can sometimes be more useful. The image generators out there now, um, they tend to be a bit more focused on like producing like art rather than um, things that you might use in a training course, but see how you go. Um, I know that, uh, yeah, it's not sort of the fancy AI solutions, but hey, it's important to do what's practical and what your course um, is, is going to make your course engaging as possible. So for uh, YouTube videos, obviously, if you're selling your course and making it public, then you're not allowed to do that without permission from the creator. But um, I find using YouTube tutorials really useful in uh, training uh, courses that are internal within uh, an organization. So uh, there's some really great websites as well, like Canva, uh, the design tool and, and Pexels, uh, the stock photo website, where you can add a lot of visual wow factor for a really low cost, sometimes even free. Canva is really easy to use uh, design tool and has heaps of templates to start with to design anything like infographics, videos, or uh, whatever you want. So uh, Pexels, yeah, as I said, really great um, place to get not only photos, but video uh, stock footage. Um, personally, I just pay for Canva Pro. Uh, it's like $20 a month and you get a bunch of more useful features plus access to a massive library of stock videos, animations, and photos that usually would be paid individually anyway. So it's quite good value for money. Another one is Loom, which I'm literally using right now to record this video. Uh, it's a great screen recording app. 
that you can use to show people how to do things on a computer. In conclusion, building a course step-by-step -step using AI tools in combination with other tools is a great way to rapidly create engaging, informative, and high quality courses. By following the steps outlined in this tutorial, you'll be able to create a course that provides value to your learners within hours or days, instead of taking months or even years.